the journey of self-growth and self-change, I want to note to our listeners, because I think if there's anyone thinking that change isn't one of the most painfully impossible things to do, you I mean, whenever you're endeavoring to a new category of falsity, like I see that I should change here and I want to grow, for example, the gym or anything, if you, if you have no competency in that area or you failed multiple times, it's like standing at the edge of a cliff. And it takes so much faith and courage to believe that this thing carried out over a course of time will change your life incrementally. You mean, because when the resistance hits, it's so much easier to default away from pain. But the, the oddest thing is that, that pain, and it's weird, I don't know if this is a perfect analogy to what you were saying, but something I've been realizing this week, and you guys know a good bit about my history, and we'll probably get more into that in the future, but you know, I'm a former quadriplegic, used to be a pretty athletic guy, um, and now I'm going to the gym quite regularly, um, and it's been my recovery process. At one point I was told I was not gonna be able to walk again, all these things. Um, but I go to the gym, to remind myself how weak I am, mm -hmm. right? I go to the gym to take my tiny dumbbells and to lift them and to just be angry and to remember there's hope and you're not where you yet should be. But then when I go to the gym and I face my fear, I have the discipline of self-love to say, look at me, I'm not who I wanna be. I, I'm weak right now and I'm weak every day of the week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and here I am going through reminding myself how weak I can, then once, Every month and a half, I go, oh, my gosh, I went up five pounds in each hand. Look at that. You know right. I mean? Yeah. Um, That's so dope. But I think That's so dope. the journey of reminding yourself you're weak, you know, is is that reset. It's that improvement of, of noticing something and saying, like, this isn't good enough anymore. Yeah.